Hi guys, I'm so excited to be filming today because this is a video I've wanted to film for so long now and I finally was like, let's do this. Some of the worst feelings of being a girl that guys just don't understand. Just why? Now before we get started with all the worst feelings, I gotta give a shout out to the sponsor of this video. Thank you so much to audible.com because without you, I would be flipping burgers instead of making YouTube videos. Seriously, probably, something like that. You guys have probably heard about them before. I've talked about them before, many YouTubers have. If you haven't, audible.com is the world's biggest library of audiobooks with over 250,000 titles, which is really amazing, like actually, wow. How do you even? If they have a book that you want, use the link audible.com slash hair. I'll have it linked below. It's also on the screen right here. And you'll get a 30 day free trial, AKA like a free audiobook, which is awesome. Since this video is very much about like girl power, I would recommend the book, Girl Boss. I love this book, it's so good, it's so entertaining. I remember when I listened to it, I listened to it all in one sitting. I just sat there and was like, it's about the founder of Nasty Gal and like how she grew up and like created this giant company and she's just bad. She's really cool, such a good book and you can read it for free with my link, so go check that out. Let's get down to business, I can't crack my... My knuckles don't crack. Thing number one that sucks and guys just don't understand is getting catcalled, okay? Like, you could be real dressed up and get catcalled. Okay, get real? No. I almost think it's funny when you just look terrible and it still happens. Really? I mean, I don't even look like a girl right now. Like, come on. I could be mistaken. Do you see? Okay, this next one is a little bit petty, but seriously, our hair takes so long to do. Yeah, I probably spend at least 30 minutes doing my hair every morning, which is two and a half hours out of a five day week, which is, if I was really good at math, I'd put some ridiculous number right here of how long I spend in my lifetime doing my hair. So you know what? That's precious time. And if you mess up my hair, I want to mess you up. And for some reason, guys just love to roll the window down. All right, Monica, I really want to put the top down. No, it's, no, no. It's warm no, enough. No, no, it's warm no, enough. No, Let's go. No, no. Oh, yeah, I really want the windows down, too. So away we go. Monica, are you trying a new hairstyle there or what? You really should brush it now and then. It just turns into a rat's nest. That was a great ride. Thanks for going with me. Um, you really ought to do something about that hairdo, though. It's really getting out of control. See you later. Number three might just be me, but I hate when girl products are specifically just pink. This is perfect. Oh, men's section, that's embarrassing. Um, oh, here are the Mariners. Wait, why do they always make the girl stuff pink? Rhinestones, glitter, highlighter pink versions of things like no we want the normal version who out there was like girls just want it in pink that's what they want like let's just dumb it down for them like girls like pink and girls like flowers girls all like the same things being really really girly and i know i'm wearing pink right now so i'm kind of a hypocrite but you know what whatever I feel like a lot of times because I'm female, people look at me and they judge me based on stereotypes and they just fill in the blanks about me. So maybe I'm wearing a Mariners jersey. Please don't get all condescending with me about baseball because I will make you look stupid. Oh, you going to the Mariner game? You gonna go hang out in the bullpen? Hope you can catch a home run. Yeah, I mean, I guess home runs are cool. Really, I'm more interested to see how Iwakuma's splitter is gonna hold up against you, Darvish and his fastball. I mean, I'm optimistic. We're only four and a half games away from the wild card spot. Like, we have a chance this year. Dad, why do you look so confused? Did I throw you for a curveball? You know, like a girl knowing sports? Me in the car, there's pretty much only two versions of me in the car. One, jamming out, having a good time. And two, being extremely paranoid someone's following me. Wait, 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 wait. Is that car following me? I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna turn right. Oh, they put their blinker on. They're following me! I need to go my one What's the phone number for 911 again? Oh wait, 911, duh. I don't want to die like this. Okay, I'm just gonna turn left, just turn left, just turn left. Oh, that was 
Here's a close one. What is this car? What does this car want? You follow me too? Huh, dude? I get really nervous. I've actually been followed like three times and one time this guy like pulled out a knife. That's a story for another time though. Oh my gosh. <laughs> and just to top it off, number seven. Pregnant? What? <laughs> no, I'm kidding. It's a thermometer. But seriously. The fact that women have to carry a child in them for nine months. Game over, guys. I feel like I see any mom and I'm like, you're amazing. How did you do it? These things do kind of suck, but I mean, also, let's just take a moment for like, it's way worse for some women around the world. So I'm kind of more so just like making fun of like the annoying things that, yeah, we have to deal with and it kind of sucks, but it could be way worse. You could be put into some arranged marriage that you had no say in, not allowed to vote, trafficked, or not allowed to wear what you want to wear or say. It's a lot worse, okay? So let, let's just take a moment to also be grateful. That's it. Thanks for watching this video. If you want to watch more of my videos, I make daily vlogs. I'll have that linked below. And follow me on Twitter at Herodynamic. I favor every tweet that I see. And then follow me on Instagram at Monica Church. And oh, subscribe to this channel if you want. All right, I'll see you guys next week.